Hello everyone. Um, today I have a video that I would like to share with you guys. And uh, this video is about lawn mower. Okay. Um, wait for me a little bit. Let me. Okay, here. I am going to make to upgrade my total time master okay from this to this okay and there are two um, two ways to do it one is the uh, easy way and one is uh, complicated way okay but I will share with you um, the way I did it, okay? Before we start, let's uh, walk to my old lawnmower. <coughs> Excuse me. I mean, um, the uh, Gravely. This, this uh, swivel is from Gravely uh, 21 inch decks, okay? Let's walk with me to that lawnmower. And here, I already took up the the swivel. You guys see that? Okay, this is my second one. Okay, um, the owner say the lawn the engine is still working. I am I, I am not sure if it's still working or not. But all I need is the swivel wheel the, for the front. Okay. So that's why I bought it for 75 and I don't want to, I don't mind to try that for to pick it up. I will tell you about the story later, okay? <coughs> and uh, before we go, I have to show you this. Keep this pork right here. I will use it later. I already have one. Uh, uh, install over there because I have two of these the uh, gravely one customer and um, the first one my customer gave it to me he uh, he don't need it and uh, he uh, told me that the engine was uh, not working and I really don't care much about it you know I just say okay I, I, I will take it home to play around with it when I took it home I I feel like I need to create something for my Toro and I sit in there and think about it and I finally I find out uh, what I need to do for my Toro um, with, uh, with this lawnmower, you know. Um, so that's why I took up the park and then uh, start, uh, install that the, uh, the swivel. Okay, this, uh, this one I bought it uh, a couple of days ago for seventy-five dollar. Okay, I have another one. Here another one. I retook the pork up from the back. See that? I'm going to clean up later. I have some like dead brain tree fell down like last week, and I still don't have time to clean it up yet. <laughs> okay, let's go back to the garage. Okay, before we go back to the garage, let me show you this. This is the Bridge Trayston uh, engine from the lawnmower. Uh, it's like what? 190cc. This has to be old one. Huh? Um, it's outside, being, it's, it's outside still look good. But the engine, I don't, I don't think it's good because I already uh, tried and it's kind of noisy. So something going on with the engine, I'm sure. Um, <clears throat> I don't need the engine anyway, you know, so that's, that's long more I, I bought it also, okay? Let me show you. Here, that engine from here. And uh, this uh, Kawasaki uh, FJ180V, I took, I took it off from the long more that in my backyard, as I showed you earlier, the one next to the sea. I took that engine and I put in this Toro, and it uh, it was working. 
I always install and I try to see how it cut. I love it very much. The engine it looks like it's more stronger than the Toro Time Master. I mean, um, than uh, than the brick straight brick straight brick straight right? Yeah, it's stronger. It, it's working. All I I <coughs> all I need right now is I'm waiting for the sleeve to put them um, into the 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 the, the shop. Because the shop we have is like one inch, and uh, this shop is I believe is uh, seven and eight or something. So now I need I need the uh, the sleeve to put it in, so I can install the how we call that thing, the one uh, holding the bell. I don't know what what that is, what it's called, but anyway, this is my original. I bought it brand new and I use it for maybe uh, two years now, almost two years I believe, and the gas tank is from that. Um, Gravely uh, 22 also, I took it up, so I put it here for temporary use, right? This one, I'm going to use that um, uh, that engine right there, the Kawasaki, I will, I, I will keep that up there, right? And this one, I'm going to replace with the Kohler um, 224cc, uh, I believe, yeah. Um, that's, that's, that was my plan. And these totals, I pay for this one right here. I, I bought it last week. It's about uh, 450, 450. The reason I bought it because I just need the the decks. I need the decks. I don't need the engine. I know it, and um, that's why I bought it for to um, 440. They say with uh, four, 450. At first they asked for 500. 50, I believe, but turn around, I bought it for 440, and um, <coughs> the deck's not that great, the deck is uh, kind of rusty, let me show you, when I bought it, I didn't pay attention to it, so the, the deck right here, it kind of, you see it's a mess up right there, yeah, I didn't know it. If I know, I can bargain down a little bit more, but it's okay, you know. Okay, uh, now I will uh, start on uh, to show you how I install that uh, uh, swivel wheels, right? Swivel wheels, excuse my English, okay? All right, I will show you the easy way first, okay? Give me one second. Okay, I'm going to show you the easy way first. I hope you see it. <laughs> the original one, okay. This is an easy way. The easy way you have to make the hole. You have to make extra hole for this right here. Because the total um, deck high is more higher than than the gravely 21 inch, okay. So that's why I, uh, I did make the hole for this right here for right here. If I use the pin to lift up the decks, because I have some customer, um, they require me to put all the way up. So if I don't make the hole, if I don't make the, the, the hole, not a hole for it, the, the front is kind of low down, maybe half inch, half inch. So the grass, when we mow the grass, it don't look right. So that's why I create one extra hole and you can see it's right here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Original from the gravely. And uh, if you can see this, how many we count over there? Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, six hole, right? It got a six hole, six hole for the pin. For the pin, for the pin. I'm sorry for my English. And this one you see, one, let me hold this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I, this one had extra hole on it, okay? Um, and, uh, and this, let me see. Oh, never mind. This pin right here, when I uh, took the lawnmower home, 
the pin is like this. You see. You see it's very short. <coughs> I'm sorry. Okay. The pin right here is short. So each time when we try to level up or level down, it kind of hard, complicated. It's very complicated. I mean, it takes time. It's not much, but still, you know. So when we put this in here, this pin I, I bought it from Home Depot to make it bigger so I can grab it fast. And just put it in here to lock it, see? So that's the first. That's an easy way to do, right? And uh, this handle right here, um, I already has it at home. And uh, it's like a pen can opener, right? I weld it in easy to grab it and move in and out, OK? So that's an easy way to do. But you have to make the hole. And I, I will uh, share with you how I make the hole, OK? For right now, I will do it right now first. I just want to finish the easy part for you guys first, okay? I, I use the tape, right? Use the tape. I tap in it to make sure it even, it line up, right? To make sure it line up on the edge. You go. Very be careful. Make sure it's smooth, okay? Give me one second. And I use one of the bow. The bow is about the size with that hole right there. It's about as, I mean, it's bigger, but you can feel it fixed in the hole, okay? And then uh, I'll try to make the hole to cut up the, the tape. Okay, there's one hole. And two hole. The reason we do this, we want to make sure they line up, line up correctly. It's not like uh, low or high. That that's the reason I I have to put the tape on right, and I keep uh, screw it, screw it until I see the hole. Okay. You see, it cut the tape up. Yeah. Now do one more. I think two is enough. I just want to make sure it's smooth so I can see inside. And uh, for the drill bit, you have to uh, to see the hole. Okay, I don't ask me what number. <laughs> I am not good on that. <coughs> <coughs> so you see, if you see, you find the drill bit that's about the same hole with like this. Okay, that's about the same. You use it. I'd be able to create stuff and share it to people, but I can, with the math, I'm very bad. I, I don't like numbers, so. Okay. And you can see the hole is very straight up, right? And then I move it down. <coughs> I move the tape down. Careful, don't, 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 don't mess up that hole from the seat. And then, I line up one hole on the top, right? There you go. Make sure it's straight with the edge. We do easy way first, okay? Okay, 
n not the second the last hole of our form original and then now we have the the hole right here to to drill it so this way make them all look even but when you drill when you start doing this hole make sure you do very slowly and um, precise you cannot move the um, uh, how we call that screwdriver, whatever you call that machine. Um, do it slowly with a small bit first, right? Very small one, and then um, keep changing, changing until to the side that you need. Okay? Do it slowly. Don't do too fast. I mean, like maybe for professional one day they probably do better than me for sure. But to me, when I I did it, I try to do it slow. So that's why when the when the hole come out, it per side, it's not like up or down or one side or the other side. You know, you know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. That's what I I did over here. Okay. And that's the easy way to do it. If you want to have the um, swivel into the toe, the time master, and you have to find the um, <coughs> swivel online. Okay. Let me share you with this, like earlier I told you. That's grave, gravely the one heaven, the, the one just only, I, I just only took up the, the swivel. That's gravely is $75. And I have to throw one hour to pick it up. Here the reason why I have to go that far. You can buy this, buy this, okay? Uh, online, yep, yeah, you'll be able to find it online. Let me tell you what, it will cost you about $289 for both of them. $289. Tax and shipping, I don't know yet, but that's the, the price they, they post online. Uh, $289 for both. And I know it without a wheel. No wheel. If you want the wheel, they probably charge you more. For one hour, go over there and one hour, back two hours. But at least I say more than $200. You see that? That's why I don't mind. I pay 75 If I keep bargain, if I have the patience to bargain, maybe they sell me $50. <laughs> yep. But to me, a few dollars more is not that big deal. And uh, this, this right here, <coughs> this right here, I reinstall it. Um, at first, I install it. I'm using the easy way, and and I'll use it for a week. I feel like uh, too much time consumed to um, move the pin uh, up and down. This is a complicated way to do it, and uh, I will show you how. Uh, how I did it, okay? All right. And uh, I will see you a little bit. Okay. Um, I took I took up this from the lawnmower that I pay for uh, seventy five. And. Uh, It's kind of rust, rusty, huh? The bearing, the bearing here, look like it is rusty. I don't know if I can use it or not. It's very bad, and I try to put some uh, what we call it's a W40. You see, it's not moving. It's supposed to be come out very easy. There you go. It's come out. This bearing, it look like still good. Yeah, still good on this one.
It's supposed to come up easy. This right here. But it's not. Let's see if it can come up. Let me see the other one. Yeah. See the other one come up? Where is it? Open, but I just wonder how to remove it. Let me see. There you go. I got it. So it's still working. Okay. And this one. This one not come up. Let's see. What reason? Must be rust. The reason I put it back, I want to make sure I cut it correct. I don't want to mess up. So I'm going to cut it right here. Or maybe right here. Yeah, maybe right here. Right there. See? Can you see the light? Okay. I want to make sure it, it works for You see? Now we have one piece of device. And now maybe I'll circle this. See this right here? We have to file it down, make it thinner. For right now, this side I filed earlier, it's just for right now. And uh, we might need to file more, but I'm not sure yet, okay? All right? <laughs> All right, not okay. All right. I just drill the hole a little bit bigger. Just drill the hole a little bit bigger. This hole is big enough for this bolt. Okay. The reason the reason I'm going to uh, drill to make the hole bigger, you will see what I'm talking about. Okay. So I'm going to use the drill bit a little bit bigger on this side. I, oh, this side, on this side, because uh, 
because this is going to stay outside. Right. I don't know if I'm correct or not. So I use the drill bit, uh, they call, uh, let's see, cannot see it, 516, maybe 516 if you can see it. So 516 is a little bit bigger than this hole, okay? <laughs> okay, you see that? One side right here, one side right here. The hole is more, the hole, the hole to the, to the lawn more, okay? Let me, give me one second. You see this right here? This side, no hole, and this side got a hole right here. So the, 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 <laughs> the less metal in, into that, um, I mean the one with the whole side is going to that long mower right there. I hope you understand what I'm saying. Okay, anyway. And then, uh, make sure I do it right. I don't want to make mistake. Um, another thing I want to say with you. When you do this, make sure you lift up the uh, the lawnmower up to like uh, letter A in the back, like maximum high, okay? To make sure they they level up, and then uh, yep, right here we have the. Okay, something like this. So I'm going to drill the hole, make the hole bigger. Here, why I make the big, bigger hole? You see that square? That square right there. The reason I make bigger, I want that square go into that hole so it can hold it. I mean, the professional, they do have two to make the square hole right here, right? But I am not a professional and I never use those, so I use this to make it bigger so I can lock into that hole right there. You know what I mean? I hope. Okay. And uh, I also want to uh, to file this a little bit thinner also. Okay, give me one second. I hope I can do that. This bowl is stainless steel. All right. <laughs> I'm going to put this in here. Oh, yeah. It's too hot. Ah, yeah. And I will use this. I can tie it in. Too hot. Still hot. Okay. See if I can do it. Yes, it's work. See. <clears throat> okay, guys. Um, finally. I have finished the uh, installation for the wheel, wheel, wheel swivel for the Toro Time Master 30 inch, right? Let me uh, show you this. <coughs> Can you see that? 
can you see? Let me move the camera out a little bit. Okay. Now you can see the <sighs> the level right here, right? If I want to uh, move it off to level off, right? I press this right here and I pull up the lawnmower and you can see uh, if you can see the number the ladder I put down here <laughs> I want to make sure the ladder, ladder F is right through the, that, that bowl right there so like I uh, say the, I don't know if I told you about but anyway this uh, ladder F I really don't use a lot. I don't use. Maybe I have one customer <laughs> to use the letter F to low all the way down. So I don't care much about the bolt right there. Um, I mark like from A to uh, to F, right? I mark it so that's why it saves me time to sit in there and couch, right? There you go. If you see the letter, can you see? Yeah, I think I think so. And this side same thing. So if I want to move with that to, to level up, it's kind of opposite. Opposite. We supposed to put this, and then uh, I don't know. I don't know how how that's work, but it work for me this way. I make it this way then. So if I want to make it higher, I press this right here, and then I pull up the lawn mow. It up. It's way easier, way easier than sitting there and then uh, do that pin, you know. To move it down, yeah, just push it. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. See? It's locked in place. Yep, that's how it works, ABC. A B C, A B C. I wish I can mark the letter somewhere over here so I can see better. But I have no room. It's better than nothing, you know. Um, and uh, I know I sk I skip a lot of the video while I'm doing it. Um, why I was doing it, okay? I don't know how to use the grandma, so I'm sorry. Um, I also weld the ball here so it can attack, it can stay in place. You see that? That's where I weld to make sure this side has something to uh, support. It won't bend out or break or whatever, you know. So that that's what I did. Actual work on that. And uh, this side, I uh, did only one ball. I only wear one one ball because um, after I did uh, this side, I say I really don't need to. I mean, if two may be better, but I don't know. I really don't need it. I, all I need it to, to protect this piece is come, not coming up, that's all. So this one, I do only one ball. And, uh, and this, this thing right here, the lever thing right here, uh, I have to break it up and then re-weld re -weld it, yeah. So this way, when we turn, when we turn, it's not against to this pie right here. See that? Um, if we don't do, if if I don't uh, cut it up and reweld it, um, this one is a little bit higher. And when 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 the swivel try to turn, it will not turn because it will uh, block it. This this thing will block it. 
so it cannot be uh, turned. So that's why I cut it off and uh, weld it back like this, and easy to use, you know. Here you go. All right, see that? And I think very much, I'm very much done with it. I already uh, create the flap to open up and down. Uh, I mean, um, open, open and close, right? So that's why I want this one to be my main uh, lawn mower. Um, that's why I want to put the, the, the good engine on this, so I can use it every day. And uh, let's see what else. I think that's very much, yeah. yeah. And uh, thank you again for your time uh, uh, to, to watch my uh, video. And uh, please leave, uh, leave the comment and um, share my video if you like. Uh, and uh, I hope you guys have a great day and uh, God bless to uh, you all. Okay? Thank you. Bye bye.